Hi, this is Cindy from CindyWebDesigns.com where I create web designs and I also have tutorials on creating a website. So check out my website when you get a chance at CindyWebDesigns.com Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to create a signature for your business email in Gmail. Okay, so let's get started. I'm in Gmail. What you do is go over to this little um, icon clock. I don't know what it's called. Click on the drop down arrow. Click on settings. It's quick and simple. Scroll down to signature, I believe. Yes. Scroll down to signature. Pick the name you want for your uh, business email. I'm going to pick this one okay now what I'm gonna do is type in what I want when I get ready to send out my emails so first thing I'm gonna do is type hello comma I'm gonna um, enter a couple times one two three four I'm gonna assign my name I'm gonna type my website address um, no, www.cindywebdesigns.com. Okay, then what we're going to do, uh, you can uh, add social icons. I'm going to click on this insert image button. I'm going to go to a folder on my desktop, which is. So when we get to this point, we're going to click on upload and we're going to click select a file from your computer. I have a folder on my desktop where I store my social icons. So that's where I'm going to get my social icons from. So I'm going to click on um, insert from computer. Then I'm going to grab an icon, uh, Facebook. You can size it to the whatever size you want. Okay. Click next to it. Space twice. Do the same thing. Go to upload. Select from the computer. Let's do a Google Plus. Open. Click on it. Make it small. Space. Two, same thing. Upload. Select from the computer. Let's do YouTube. You can add as many icons as you want. Okay, so now you can also change the fonts. Now you can highlight your name or highlight this information, whatever you want to change. Click on that and make it larger. It comes out bigger. You can bold it, make it bold. Italic. Okay, you can also add a link to this. So I'm gonna link my website address. Okay, I'm gonna, you can also link your Facebook, Google, and YouTube by just clicking on this little link icon. Since I don't have, um, I don't have one set up as of yet. At the time of this recording, I'm going to leave it blank for now, but all you have to do is click on the link. Once you complete it, just scroll down to save. Voila, it's done. Now, I'm going to test it out. What I'm going to do is um, compose an email. I'm going to use my drop down and pick the name that I want, that I want to use. I think it's this one. As you can see, it populates itself. Okay, so I'm going to send it to my other email address. Let's try um, this one. And the subject will just say test. And we'll just do, we'll type right in here, test, testing. Okay, then we hit send. Now what I'll do is I'll go back to my email address that I send it to. Let's see. 
Okay, so I'm in my email address that I send my test email to. And voila, here it is. See? Voila, all done. I hope this helps. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, leave me a comment, and subscribe. And check out my website at cindywebdesigns.com. See you on the next video.